Hello, Rabbit Raisers. This is Dave here from Rabbit Empire, and today I'd like to show you exactly how you can use our easy rabbitry management software to easily and effectively manage all of your rabbitry records. First things first. When you first receive the program CD, in most cases, you can simply pop it into your computer and click on the Setup option that pops up to proceed with installing the program. If for whatever reason it doesn't pop up, or you receive an error message, simply go to My Computer, click on the CD, and double-click on the Setup file to proceed with the installation. Installation should only take about a minute, so no worries with regards to time constraints. Once the program successfully installs, the program window will usually pop right up, allowing you to instantly use the software. Now, if no window pops up, simply double-click on the Easy Rabbitry Management Software icon that should have been added to your desktop. Alternatively, you can simply go to Windows, Programs, Easy Rabbitry Management Software to load the software up. All right. So now you should be looking at the program menu window with the message Welcome to the Easy Rabbitry Management Software on it, which you will see every time you open the program. Here, you can either choose to create a new database or load an existing database. Now, since we just installed the program and therefore wouldn't have previously created any databases, I'll just click Create a New Database. On the pop up window, just enter a name for your database, such as ABC Rabbitry, which I'll be using for demonstration purposes, and click OK. All right, so now we are looking at the main software interface here, which we will be using to store and create Rabbitry records. To proceed with adding records, simply click on the File menu, and then on the corresponding Records tab that you would like to create a record for. If you have had any experience using the computer, you should find this process very self-explanatory, like we intended it to be when we created this program. Now for the purpose of this tutorial, let me go ahead and create an example record. First off, let me create a breeding record by clicking on the Add Breeding Record tab. To add a breeding record, enter a date of breeding. If you don't have an exact date, just aim to make a close guess as these records will most likely be used for personal record keeping purposes. Now, for the purpose of this tutorial, I'll just enter July 1st of 2013. Next, enter the doe ear tag or name of the doe that you breed and the rabbit that you breed her to in the following box. Also, if you wish, you can add breeding notes in the final box here. And once you've filled out the fields, just hit the Add Record button to add the breeding record. In the same way that we added a breeding record, you can add buying, contract, finance, health, kindling, journals, selling, and show records using the program. To generate and print out records that you have just added to the program, you can use the Generate Records tab. Before going to generate a record, use the main screen to specify a date range for which of the records to generate for. For instance, if you wanted to generate a yearly report of all breeding records, you could set the start date as January 1, 2013, for instance, and the end date as December 31, 2013, and then go to Generate Records, then Generate Breeding Record. Once you complete these simple steps, a spreadsheet will be generated using Adobe Reader that you can easily save to your computer in PDF format or print out directly. Please note, to generate records, you will need to have Adobe Reader on your computer. If you don't already have Adobe Reader, simply Google Adobe Reader and you will find a link where you can download the latest version of the program free of charge. If at any time you wish to edit pre-existing records, you can utilize the Edit Delete Records tab on the main file menu. For instance, to edit the breeding record we created a minute ago, we would go to Edit Delete Records, then Edit Breeding Record. After doing that, you'll see a table looking edit box where you can change any of the existing data by double-clicking within a box, changing the data, and then clicking the Save button. Now, if you wish to delete the entire record, simply select the row, click Delete Record, and then hit the Save button. All right, so now that I have walked you through the process of creating and editing records, let me briefly talk about Reminders, a new feature that we've added to the program. So essentially, using the New Reminders tab on the program, you can input reminders related to your rabbitry that you can go back and view at a later date, using the View Future Reminders sub-tab. 
Now, using this feature, you can remind yourself of important dates related to rabbit shows, for instance, or rabbitry-specific dates, such as when you need to input a nest box in your rabbit's cage. Just be sure that you check this tab frequently if you do choose to use this program feature. Lastly, let me talk briefly about backing up your files. Using our Easy Rabbitry Management software, you can easily back up your program files and even import them back into the program with a click of a button. Now to back up your program files, simply go to File, then Backup, and select a folder location that you wish to back up your files to. Now personally, I will use a flash drive to back up my records frequently. However, you can use any method you wish. To import the program files back into the program, you'll need to go to File, then Import Backup, and simply select the folder that contains the backup. It's really that simple. Alright, so that officially wraps up this Easy Rabbitry Management Software tutorial video. If you have any further questions or would like to send us feedback, you can do so via info at rabbitbreeders.us. Repeat, that is info at rabbitbreeders.us. All right, this is Dave here from Rabbit Empire signing off in excitement once again. I hope you all have a great experience using our software. You can additionally find other pieces of software that we sell available via rabbitbreeders.us. Take care and good luck to you all.